This is the boundary between air and glass, and this is a normal line. And this is a light ray that is refracting or bending at the boundary. We say that the light ray has refracted towards the normal line. That is, the incident ray is further from the normal line than the refracted ray is. When does this happen? It happens when light passes from a less optically dense medium to a more optically dense medium. Optical density is directly related to the index of refraction value and inversely related to the speed of light. So we can say it also happens when light passes from a low index medium to a high index medium or changes its speed from fast to slow. What happens when light passes from a more dense medium to a less dense medium, such as from glass to air? The light ray refracts away from the normal line, that is, the refracted ray is farther from the normal line than the incident ray is. This happens for light passing from a more dense medium to a less dense medium, from a high index medium to a low index medium, or changes its speed from slow to fast. So by observing how light refracts at the boundary, either towards or away from the normal line, you can make some predictions about the relative speed within optical density of or index of refraction of the two media. The rules will work whether the boundary is horizontal or vertical or oriented in any such direction. I'm Mr. H, letting you know that you got this.